such a long road. Can this really be the end of it? It's time to say farewell. If reason fails, try force. If you want to keep her, you must let her go. Oh my god, everyone has a chance. It's your moment. No, say it isn't so. It's almost time to say so long to Downton Abbey and the characters so many of us have come to love. PBS's award-winning series wraps up Sunday night in a special two-hour finale. But before we say goodbye, we're saying hello to Leslie Nickel, Mrs. Patmore, and Phyllis Logan, Mrs. Hughes, live from Los Angeles this morning. Hey, ladies, good to see you. Hi, Hi Carrie. Uh, good morning, Dallas. Good morning, Dallas. Yes, Dallas, Fort Worth. I hear you guys have been singing and dancing all morning long. We were doing a little tribute to you, Carrie, called oh, Billy. Carrie, Carrie Baby, Carrie, Carrie Baby. You guys are Except good. It's not the wrong name, the but wrong. Really, Sherry. You really, that's yeah. true, but we'll take it. Hey, we have so much to ask the two of you. We have so many fans here in the studio, but so little time, so let's get to it. The Crawleys and staff have experienced so many post-war changes. We've said goodbye to key players along the way. What will both of you miss most about the show? We'll miss each other and, and the crew. And I just loved going to work yeah, on it every day. It was day. a great job. It, it was, was a great job. Really unusual and yeah. happy. Happy. And happy. Close to home. With a All kinds of good things. <laughs> what were these toasts? What has it been like working with such an amazing have... cast, too? And the guest appearances, like... Hugh Bonneville, Elizabeth McGovern, Maggie Smith especially, Shirley MacLaine, Paul Giamatti, the list goes on and on. Well, it was a, a terrific bunch of actors. I mean, that's the truth. And yes. that makes your job easier. And it's, um, it's a blessing. And there were no awful people. They were all lovely people, absolutely every one of them. Um, that makes a difference to anybody's job, whatever you do for a living. And you had, we had a laugh, didn't we? We did have a we laugh. We had fun. Oh, yes. Oh, we yes. did a lot of laughing, we did. <laughs> well, let's talk characters for a second. Leslie, Mrs. Patmore just opened her B&B. &B. Everyone got a little chuckle at her expense when it gained a reputation for yes. unsavory liaison. So, will she spend that dream of retirement alone, or will the blossoming friendship between her and Mr. Mason evolve into perhaps something more? Only Lord Fellows, the writer, knows that the answer to that uh -huh. question. <laughs> but I've been pushing, I can tell you now. For a boyfriend. For, for a boyfriend, for some years. Um, and I had one for about five minutes, if you remember, that grocer. That guy came and went. Um, so, but it's all up to him. You know, we have one writer and it all comes out of his head. So I can only suggest. So we have to stay tuned is basically what I'm you're feeling saying. a boyfriend. I wanted a dog. Well, Phyllis, yeah, I didn't get a dog either. <laughs> Phyllis, your character, Mrs. Quite Hughes, nice, and head maybe. butler, Mr. Carson, finally got married. Both are in their later years. They've had some marital growing pains. Are they going to be truly happy? We want them to be truly happy. Yes, I do as well. And I think, you know, once he's got over his initial little thing, I suppose it's just adapting to life suddenly. Yeah, it's a big change, It right? is a huge change. Can you imagine? Yeah. They've lived all their lives as single people up to this point. Um, suddenly to be thrown together in that way. And as Mrs. Patmore says, no one's seen him without his togs on. I don't even know if you'd understand that expression. Yeah, togs, clothes. Oh, togs, clothes. Oh. Um, I know. <laughs> big change. Be. Fortunately, Mrs. Hughes's eyesight isn't all it should be, so <laughs> that's fine. That's well, really. let's talk Lady Mary. Finally got married, too. Is Lord Grantham really ready to hand over the reins of the Downton Abbey estate to her? To handle? Hand over the reins to her. I think he's getting there. Yes. I think so. She's, she's matured quite a lot, hasn't she? Yes. She's stopping. And she looks well capable she does actually, of... Yeah. Um, I think we, on that the job. thing is, we've in later years realised how many strong women there are in this show. Actually, I mean, she being a fine example of it. But they're, they're, they're yes, Daisy as well. So Daisy's finding her feet. Oh, all the women are kind of, kind of tough. Yeah, mm. yeah. it's kind of tough. Strong. Okay, what about Edith? Will Bertie find a way to trust and forgive her for not telling him that Marigold was her We're daughter? We're not going to tell you that. We're not going to tell you anything about that because you need to see the final episode, I think. Which they're going to on Sunday. Which you're going to on Sunday. So we won't ruin that one, but it's nice. But it was a shocker, actually. She, yes. uh, Lady Mary, no, she let the cat out of the bag. Yes, she was bad. That was bad. I think she was a bitch. 
Ladies, one Happy final Netflix question I gotta ask you. The series has won so many awards, most recently the SAG Award for the cast. And Leslie, you accepted the award on behalf of the rest of the cast. What did that moment mean to you? Oh, <laughs> ooh, it was a real mixture. When, when our name was, was called out, honestly, I don't think we thought we were gonna win for a number of reasons. We've already ha ha won twice and, and the... Um, All these fantastic amazing shows. Amazing shows we were up against. So, so it was a mixture. Then somebody took a picture, actually, of the moment where you can see me going, "Yay!" <laughs> oh, because I knew I was speaking, and it was, it was. Uh, and then actually, I slightly forgot to speak. And when we got on the stage, I just stood there, and Joe went, "Let's go!" Oh, oh. <laughs> so it was a bit like jumping off a cliff. But um, I was very honoured to be asked. The, the, the cast actually asked me to do it which meant a huge amount to me. Absolutely. Hey, we are honored to talk to the both of you, and I know so many people are looking forward to the series finale. Thanks again. Thank you. Thanks, Carrie. All bye, right. Dallas. Bye, 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 bye. Okay, again, all questions will be answered on the final episode of Downton Abbey this Sunday at 8 p.m. on KEO.